the reproductive gene. Item number, SCP-324. Object class, Keter. Special Containment Procedures SCP-324 is to be kept in cold storage, except when being tested. No multicellular life, except researchers, are to be allowed near SCP-324. Researchers near SCP-324 should not touch it and should pick it up with grasping equipment. SCP-324 should, when being tested, always be tested in a garbage compact to allow quick termination of testing. SCP-324 is never to come into contact with a giant squid, and organisms that could be infected with it are not to be allowed into oceans. Description: SCP-324 is a gel containing a gene, SCP-324-1, that somehow can attach itself to other genes. Within minutes of a life form, being exposed to SCP-324, most cells will have the gene in it. Single cellular life forms die when infected with SCP-324. Chordates display no effect, but can spread the gene to those who touch them. However, when a non-chordate is infected with SCP-324-1, its reproductive system rapidly changes. Regardless of how it reproduced before, it will begin to reproduce asexually by budding. The buds grow within seconds into organisms, much like their parent. It reproduces at a speed that defies standard physical laws, as it outputs more matter than it intakes while reproducing. Organisms infected with SCP-324-1 must be destroyed as quickly as possible. Document number 324-1 A researcher with athlete's foot was handling SCP-324 and came into contact with it. Three minutes later, the fungus began growing massively and covered his body. The area was later sterilized using data expunged.